Hello Devil Hunters. In this video I'm going to teach you how to download Devil May Cry Peak of Combat on PC and also show you the best way to set up your layout for the game. If you love Devil May Cry Peak of Combat, please drop a like and also subscribe to keep me motivated. Let's not make it any longer. Let's start. First, go to your internet browser and search for Devil May Cry Peak of Combat. Then go to their official website, which I will put the link to below in the description. When you're on their website, you'll see four options below. The App Store for iOS, Google Play for Android, Official APK, and Official Emulator. Choose the Official Emulator and click it. It will download LD Player 9. Find the LD Player 9 installer you have downloaded, run it, and click Install. It will download and install the emulator and the Devil May Cry Peak of Combat. Just wait for it to finish. LD Player 9 enables users to play Android games, and use different kinds of applications on PC. So what it does is emulate an Android device on your PC, and it will act as a mobile phone inside your PC. You could also download other mobile games using this emulator. Once it finishes installing, it will go directly to the game. Just wait for a moment and the game will run. It will download the resources of the game, and after a while, it will let you choose between necessary resources and all resources. Since you are using a PC, I recommend downloading all the resources, but you could also choose the necessary only. After you choose, it will continue to download the resources. You can watch the cutscene while you wait for it to download. I will just fast forward it to save you time. After it finishes downloading, you can log into your account. You can choose Facebook, Google, or email. You can also log into your existing account if you have one. After you log in, you can choose any server you want here. And if you have an existing account logged in, just choose the server that you have already played on, and now you can enter the game. Now go to Options or Settings, and go to Custom Setup, so that we can start to make our layout for the game. Here, you can adjust where you put your button and change its size. I will change my joystick size to 85, and adjust it accordingly. Since we are using a PC, you can make all the buttons as small as possible, and put them at the side so that they do not take up more space and have a cleaner interface. You can follow my setup, or you could make your own setup the way you like it. Now for the most important part, press this button to set your key map settings. Now adjust this button at the center of your joystick and make it slightly bigger than your joystick. Trace the other buttons except for these buttons and adjust the one and two buttons for switching hunters. Now we need to set the other buttons. To add a key map, simply click where you want to set your keys. For example, if I want this button to be pressed when I press E in my keyboard, just click and I'll press E in my keyboard, and now it is set to E. You can choose what keyboard button you want and repeat for the other buttons. Just make sure that you adjust it in the center of each button. You could also follow my setup. For the attack button, I'll set it as my right arrow key, shift key for the dash or dodge, space for jump, left arrow for this, upward arrow for the ultimate, and downward arrow for this, and just make sure to adjust it to make sure it hits the right buttons and Q button for this. And don't forget to put this for you to rotate your screen. I'll set it as 8 for going up, 2 for going down, 4 for going left, and 6 for going right. After you set all your keys, don't forget to click save and also save again. Now for the graphics, you can set it up the way you want it. For me, I want to go for the highest settings. After you're done, click save again. If you have any problems with your buttons not responding just like this, I press the key for the attack button 
but it's not responding. If you have similar problems, just check your key map settings again. Make sure that your key map settings don't have any problems like this. If you have, just set it again and you're good to go. You could also put a key map for your auto mission. And you could also put a key map here for this button. And there you have it, Devil Hunters. You can now enjoy playing Devil May Cry Peak of Combat on your PC. You could also watch my other video if you want to know more about how to grind and where to get free gems in Devil May Cry Peak of Combat. If this video is helpful for you, please leave a like and comment if you have any questions. Please subscribe.